Welcome back. I am going to be reviewing this Hydrocell water bottle. I just got it in today. I'm super excited to share it with you. I've been waiting all day to open it, um, but I wanted to make a video so we could all see it at the same time. So this is one of the caps that goes for it. This is the one that connects to the straw. That's one of the reasons why I got it. Ooh, bubble wrap. Slip resistant grip tech innovation. I got the I think it was navy blue. This is one of the caps. Ooh, it's vacuum sealed, you hear that? Oh, it's got that straw. It's got some direction. It's like, get it out. Zero condensation on the outside, so it's not gonna like get all sweaty and, you know, awful. Yeah, I got the 32 ounce one. I wanted to see the size before I get another one from Michael. Didn't want it to be too big, and I didn't want it to be too small. So this is a 32 ounce. It's pretty, it's pretty big, you know? It's not bad. Uh, I like it because it has a wide mouth, which is really good for cleaning. It's hand wash only, uh, but you can fit a lot of ice and a lot of water in here. It's BPA and plastic byproduct free. I got these water bottles because I've had, had a couple water bottles recently that were stainless steel, non-leachable, and it kept ice really cold for a long time. The reason why I got this one, I needed a water bottle that was easy to clean because my other two like were very skinny up top near the rim. One of my friends at work has one and it looks really cool and she said she loves it. So I was like, I gotta check it out for myself. So we're gonna be going on a road trip and we have to go, I think it's like 12 hours in total and I'll be making a video and I'll share it with you guys. So when I get back from 4th of July, I'll definitely upload another video so you guys can see my little getaway. That is the reason behind this. I'm gonna try it out at work tomorrow and I'll show you a video. We'll see how long it keeps the ice cold for. I'll also try it on the road trip and see how it does. Stay tuned. <laughs> so this is the hydrocell. I just filled it with ice water. It's around 6.30 in the morning. I have a 12 hour shift, so at the end of it, I'll let you know how it did with um, keeping the ice and uh, keeping the drink cold. I will update you later on today. I just wanted to give you a quick update on the water bottle. Um, I guess it does not fit in my cup holder. This is the 32 ounce. I did not know this when I bought it. Oh, it's a bummer, I'm not gonna lie, but it's not a deal breaker for me. Like I can just, you know, put it on my seat with all my stuff, my lunch bag and my, you know, backpack or put it in my backpack, but just thought I'd let you guys know. Hey guys, quick update on the Hydrocell water bottle. It actually lasted 12 hours, my 12 hour shift. So I was pretty impressed. Around three o'clock, the ice completely melted. However, when I got off shift, the water was still ice cold. So I'm pretty impressed. I wanted to let you guys know that I got another water bottle um, because the other one we uh, had Michael used. Yeah, a little bit easier to hold. It's not as heavy. So definitely it'll be my hiking water bottle, I think. This one's the 24 ounce and it's doing pretty well. It actually fits in the cup holder, which I like, and it keeps the water really cold, just like the other one. Um, but yeah, we'll see how it does on the road trip. So I wanted to finish up this video that I started on these water bottles. I ended up getting this first, this 32 ounce bottle and uh, it did awesome, but it was a little bit too big for me. So then I kind of went on and bought this 24 ounce, which is a lot skinnier and it's easier to, for me to hold versus this one. It's like, I can't go all the way around. Um, but yeah, these bottles are awesome. I'm loving them. And Michael is actually in love with this one that I gave him since it's too big for me. He literally takes it everywhere. He's always using it. The water's always cold. He probably only fills it up like once a day. I definitely fill mine twice a day, but all day it's cold so as long as you put a lot of ice in there you're good they definitely lasted the road trip too they were really helpful keeping us hydrated because you know you can only drink so much gatorade and energy drinks and coffee i definitely recommend it My honest opinion they're awesome you'll love them if you got any questions just put them down in the comments and if you like these videos please like and subscribe to support this channel i'll keep giving you my honest reviews on these cool products